Rob here from robcoven.com. This is a quick tutorial about how you link text frames in InDesign and Illustrator. And I'm going to give you an example with some calendars I made for 2011 of how to link text boxes. So we're starting off, we're in InDesign now, and I've got three text boxes here. We're going to use very big type in this example, but that's um, not usually the size of type you'll be using with linked text boxes, it will usually be body text. But here we are, I'm going to type some stuff in now, which is going to overflow from the text box. The text frame has its overflowing icon here, that's the red plus sign. What you can do to link them, link it to the next text box, is simply with the V selection tool, click on the red overflowing text icon, hover over to the neighbouring text box that you want to link it to and wait for the link icon there and click into that text box. If you want to force type to go uh, to the next text box with the type tool you can just insert it where you want the type to break and hit enter on your keypad and then that will jump to the next text box. Here again I'll show you, I'll link it to the next text box. If you want to cut the link, you can just double click in the icon now, which is showing a blue arrow, um, rather than the red plus, and that breaks the link. Here in my example of the calendar, I have, um, this is February 2011, all these boxes are linked. So if you if you want to make uh, February 2012, get the type tool T, click right before the one, and then hit enter on your keypad, and there you have February 2012, starting on a Wednesday and finishing on a Thursday. If I just delete that, then February 2011 starts on a Tuesday and finishes on a Monday. Now Illustrator is exactly the same. I've got three text boxes here. I'm going to go into outline mode just so you can see them. I'm going to type in some text and again here you see the red plus overflowing icon and hover over the next text box waiting, waiting for the chain icon and there it is. Click on the red plus, hover over and wait for the chain icon and there the boxes are linked. Similarly if you want to stop the chain, double click in one of the, the beginning of one of the threads. And here in my example in Illustrator is a 2011 calendar. I've linked all the text boxes here in January in all of the months and all you have to do is with your type tool to change January 2012 which starts on a Sunday just go 26 and enter there and there you'll see it starts on the Sunday all of the text has moved on into the next text box and it finishes on a Tuesday we'll delete that to put it back to January 2011. Thank you very much. This has been a short tutorial about linking text frames or text boxes in InDesign and Illustrator. If you wanted to download any of these calendars, you can do so at my site at robcoven.com. I'll put the link below this video. Uh, if you like this tutorial, don't forget to vote for it or to say that you liked it on YouTube or whatever site you saw it on. Also, you can go back to my site and tweet or share or like the blog post. And I appreciate that or leave a comment. Otherwise, have a great day. This is Rob from robcoven.com. Goodbye.